Hey, what's going on everybody? It's ETA Prime back here again. And today I wanted to show you guys how to set up Reamcast on your Android device to play Dreamcast games. On your Android phone, tablet, Android TV, pretty much any Android device that has beefy enough hardware to run the Dreamcast emulator, this tutorial will work on it. I am using a Mad Cats Mojo Android TV, but this will work on tablets and phones and any other device that runs Android. It might be a little different navigation, but everything will basically be the same. So the Dreamcast emulator that's on Google Play is named Reencast. Recast. Reencast or Recast. I'm not sure of the proper pronunciation of it. But it requires a BIOS file. So first things first, let's go ahead and download that BIOS file that we need. There are two specific BIOS files that we will need. We're going to open up a browser on our Android phone or tablet or Android TV. You can also download these on your computer and transfer them directly to the Android device if you prefer doing that. And in Google, we're just going to search Dreamcast. BIOS. Now there are plenty of places to download the BIOS from. When running the recast on Android, it needs to be named specifically. So what we're going to do is just go to loveroms.com. They already have it ready for us. And I do not want that. And we're just going to click download for Android, the Dreamcast BIOS. Now the Dreamcast BIOS for Android, starting download. So when that's done downloading, we're going to go to Google Play. We're going to download two apps here. First app being ES File Explorer. Now there are plenty of file explorers on Google Play that you can use. I prefer using ES File Explorer. I've been using it for years and it's my go-to file explorer. We're going to install this. Next, we're going to need to download Recast Dreamcast Emulator. So you can just type in Dreamcast Emulator if you'd like or just type in R-E-I-C-A-S-T. We're going to install this. Now that we have both of these installed, we are going to open up ES File Explorer. And I'm going to go to Local, Home. I'm going to create a new folder inside of my Android directory here on my home folder. So I'm going to hit new folder and I'm just going to name it dream. You can name it whatever you want as long as you remember what you named it. So we have a new folder in our home directory named dream. Let's back up. We're going to go and open up Reencast now. So, you want to click on this, the three little lines here, and we're going to go to Paths because we need to show the Dreamcast emulator where our BIOS files are located. We're going to go to Browse. And we are going to go to the dream folder that we just created. Dream, select current folder. We're going to back out of recast. We're going to open up ES File Explorer again. We're going to find our downloads folder, which should be in our home section here. And we need to find the BIOS zip that we just downloaded. And we need to extract the BIOS zip so you can long press on it. You can go to more 
Extract 2, Dreamcast BIOS. Now that we have the Dreamcast underscore BIOS unzipped, we need to go in all the way, DC data. And inside of here, we have a DC underscore boot dot bin and a DC underscore flash dot bin. We need to copy both of these files. So long press right here at the bottom, copy. We need to go home. And the dream folder that we created will have data. And we want to paste these into the data folder in the dream folder that we created. So your dream folder should look like this after you set it up. Data, DC underscore boot dot bin and DC underscore flash dot bin. We can go out and I am going to restart recast. So I'm just going to Now we can boot the Dreamcast BIOS. But we need ROMs now. So you need to find a place to download ROMs. There are plenty of places online to download ROMs. I have a few on my SD card. So to find your ROMs, you can go back to the three little lines over here. Go to Paths and Storage Path for your games. This will direct the recast to go to where your games are located. Now if you download them straight to your phone, they're probably in your download section. But I have downloaded them and I have placed them on an SD card. I'm going to browse. We're going to select current folder. When we go back, I'll have my three games that I have installed on my USB stick listed here and ready to play. One more thing, if you're using a touchscreen, it should be set up for you. If you're using a controller, you'll need to go to Input, Customize Physical Controls. We're going to launch the editor here. I'm just going to map these out real quick. So my A button, B button, X button, Y button, LT, RT, and my D-pad up, down, left, right, and we'll have a start button also here and our select button. Now you're ready to play some Dreamcast games. Let's go ahead and boot one up. you're now playing Dreamcast games on your Android device. Now 50 hertz for most of these games will work. I, when I choose 60 hertz on a lot of these games, it just goes to a black screen. So I always choose 50 hertz display. Go to training mode.
as you can see, runs pretty good. If you have a Snapdragon 800 or higher, uh, Tegra 4, anything like that, you should have no problem running these games at full speed. So we're going to get back, back out of here. You can do that by touching the X here on the screen. And back. We'll just go home. That's it, guys. That's how to install and set up your Dreamcast emulator on your Android device. Uh, hope this helped you out. If you got any questions, leave them in the comments or send me a private message. And thanks for watching.